Okay, so now I want to talk about the budget project. If you go to the Google Classroom that I set up for teachers, Handy Dandy Economics Resources, the stream, there's really not much on the stream with the new Google, so you have to go to Classwork. Um, scroll down to the budget project. Um, unfortunately, there's a lot listed there, so you're going to have to click on the view more because the beginning of it is under the view more. So the first thing I did is I put some videos for kids to watch to describe what a budget is and why they need a budget. So there's a lot of different videos that are resources for you. Check them out. Some of them are horrible. Some of them are good. Choose what works best for you um, to repost on your own Google site or not. Don't have to do any of it. Um, the first page in the budget project is called the income page. So if I go into the income page, what there's going to be on each of these sections, I'm going to post an instructional video for the students. Um, I'll be doing that along the way a little bit at a time. So there'll be a video of me explaining the um, specific project. But to get you started in case you want to jump in, um, the first page is the actual budget project. It's digital. It has links um, involved. So before they actually do the budget project, they have to finish the career project and choose a job. So for instance, they could choose um, plumber as their career. And so they would first fill out plumber as their career, the education that a plumber should require and a yearly salary. Um, one of the places to find that is to go to this BLS search resu results. They probably will already have it from their career project if they did a good job on their career project of finding that. But this is a link that you can just search in um, plumber. You do a search for plumber. And if you open it up, it's going to give you um, the roundabout um, uh, like job description of a plumber and how much they would make a year. So you can get that. You can get their um, education. So any kid that needs to ha have help with like what the pay is for their job, they can do that. So if I go back to the budget project, they'll list their career, their education, and their yearly salary. Um, within this income page, there's some budget to tell about like what a salary is and what a paycheck is. But basically, they're going to use this link. This link is a calculator to calculate net pay um, from their gross pay. So this is a little picture right here that shows they're going to, um, when they click on this link, they put in their annual salary into the first spot. And again, I'm going to make an instructional video for students because it's hard to teach them this at home. Um, they're going to choose monthly as their pay. They're going to file single. And um, the, the, the number of allowances will stay all of these things. And when they press calculate, it's going to give them their gross pay, their federal income tax, their Social Security, their Medicare, their state tax city, um, and then it'll give them their net pay. So they fill that in there. Um, and I'll be more specific on the video for the kids. Down at the bottom, they need to figure based on the amount of education they've had for their job. So a plumber was, I think it said post high school, some training. So on the job training, it might've had a two year degree for community college. They'll move this number in for the amount of student loans that they need to repay. So they can put their monthly net pay here and their student loan payment there. And when they get to the bottom, those that's what they um, have filled out. Um, and then that page will be done and they can share it with you. Each page is its own separate page. Uh, so let's see if I can go back to this. So income. The next thing it'll be is your apartment. When you open up the apartment page, there'll be some videos here to explain like what apartment expenses are. And then I'll do an instructional video. You can do your own instructional video or not at all. Again, it's your choice. But you open up the budget project, each page has questions and it's based on a link. Um, so the blue link at the top will give a place where they can find apartments and then all of the information that's on the page, they will fill out. So this is the link where they can find apartments in Nashua. Then, then they put their property name, location, all of those things, okay? Then they'll put their monthly rent and all those things um, down below. Um, so I'm going to run out of time with this video, um, but basically you can go back to each um, section and it'll show apartment, car, menu, and groceries, entertainment, eating out, etc. So one page at a time. I'll make instructional videos as we go along. Okay, more later. Thanks.